Okay, welcome back to the channel, everybody. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Uh, for a limited time, if you subscribe to the channel, you'll get a 100% free subscription. Cool. Okay, got some parts for my bikes. Got a uh, brand new battery for this bike, brand new battery for this bike, and got a brand new battery for the one in the shop. Um, Got a new oil filter for this, four quarts of oil, new battery terminals for this. Uh, show you that they are batteries and they're not just a box. I don't know why people do such things, but you never know. <coughs> oh it is a brand new battery. And they put the acid in it to charge it up. I got them at the Motorcycle shop, so they are the legit batteries for this bike. They're not just some clunky thing I bought at Walmart. And of course, same thing with this puppy too. Brand new. Okay, now that we get that out of the way, um, my one bike is in the shop getting some work done and uh, that one, like I said, that one's also getting a brand new battery. So all three bikes are getting a brand new battery. Cool. Let me take this thing off the tripod there. All right. So this one here is an 81 Suzuki, and it is 40 years old. This is an 82 Kawasaki, and it is 39 years old. So these are both teakers, teakers, squeakers, whatever you want. Uh, this one does have the um, the full. Uh, uh, what do I want to say? The parts bag that comes with hardware. There you go. Duh. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, this one over here, it had more than what this guy was telling me. Uh, I found some electrical things, not major stuff, just you know, it would have been nice if the guy was honest um I took the backrest here that the cat had ripped up, not my cat, the guy got it off of and it's getting professionally reupholstered and that clips right on there so this thing will be all cherry now the bike that's in the shop when that gets out of the shop the seat off of that is going to get reupholstered so I'll have a brand new seat on that. Already talked to the guy. Guy was pretty cool. So the 82 Kawasaki, that's that red one over there. So far I'm into it right now for $809. The big one here behind me, I'm into that one for $636.92. And the one that's in the shop, that'll go up. Uh, 5, 25, 24. Like I said, this one's getting the backrest done, so that'll go up. And that one's going to get the new seat done, plus the whatever the shop's going to charge me. I uh, hope they don't rake me too bad. So that'll go up. But, uh, yeah. These are all going to go to market. They're all going to be on flea bay when I'm done with them. Uh, I'm going to do the oil. I'm waiting on the gasket for this right here. It's the only thing holding me up. Got the battery, got the oil, got the filter, need the gasket. And then uh, polish it up and this thing's gone, eBay. Boom. The other one over here, he did a title search on all three of these bikes. And none of them came up with anything. Even the one that's registered to me and everything. Um, this one's got me kind of worried because the guy sold it to me, said it was just for parts. Um, I was thinking about going to fix it up, talking to the Kawasaki guy in Siloam Springs, Arkansas. He was telling me carburetors. Of course, I know all this stuff. And we were discussing about, you know, it could be the valves could be bent, warped, not seating, not closing. You know, it could be a hundred different things. And uh, I was going to keep this because where are you going to get a, you know, good looking bike like that for 700 bucks? Uh, you just aren't. But, um after kicking it around thinking about it twice or three times or whatever i decided no we're just going to list that 
We're going to do what I can to it and then list it as not running. And I'm going to check further on the title to make sure, because uh, there is a lien holder, but when I ran the uh, bin verified, it did not come back as anything. It bounced back with nothing. So maybe it's paid off, maybe it's not. I don't know. But rather than stick it to somebody, I'll make sure it's good and legit before I post it on Fleabay. So this one over here I know is good. Uh, the only other thing I need to get for this bike is the uh, antenna right there. It's just a little bit antenna you could get off a boom box or something like that. No big deal. But this bike all runs and works and everything. <coughs> Supposedly. But who knows? We'll see. But uh, anyhow, like I said, when, you, when you're um, doing stuff like this, if you want to focus, uh, make sure you write down everything. I mean, every little fart and thing, you know, costs money. And you want to see at the end of the day if you're making money, breaking even, or losing, you know. Nobody wants to lose. So anyhow, there you go. So that's just a heads up what's going on here at the toys. And... Uh, did sell the Mercury Mountaineer, my boat anchor, back to the original people who stiffed me with it. And they're making payments, so got that sold for 3500 bucks. Cool. And had the garage door open and have more light, but then it decided to rain, so it is what it is. Till next time. Later.